any any oil is kosher for Neir Hanukkah. Ava b'shen Hashmonim Shokam Achav Silov Ena Nikola Yofa Boisen Absilos. Amen. Because Shabbos, uh, we say it's only Mishnah Bura, but we, yeah. I mean, we're all familiar with the Sugi, we're learning the Gemara. Lagavi Shabbos, we said that there is uh, uh, natives of Psyllus that are not kosher. Uh, ben, you got a booklet? No. Is there, is there a booklet there? No. Otherwise, I have a booklet here. Is there a booklet there? Finish here. Finish. Here. We have six of them. Oh. It doesn't matter. All kinds of wicks, all kinds of oils are kosher. Miu, Shemazayis, Mitzvah, and Mufcha. Shemazayis is the best. We mean Shemazayis Motsui. If you can't find Shemazayis, Mitzvah, the Shemazayis, Mitzvah, the Shemazayis, 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 the yeah. Our minig is to use shahim. But but the, no, for everything. Now, the way that Amos says it, it because kemoy shaman. There are those that say it's better than shaman. He doesn't say it's better than shaman. He says kemoy shaman. Sound from, so different from the Ramon you take that if you could find shaman for the same price, it was hard to find in Eastern Europe to find shaman zayis. Shaman zayis is not so much produced in the middle in in, in the Middle East. It's produced. But uh, in in Krakow, in the Stutt, because there's no Zeisse Shmanim there, because it has to be in a different climate. In Poland, there is no, yeah, there is no Ilone Zeisim in 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 uh, Eastern Europe. In cold places, yeah, Eretz Yisrael, it's all over. They're native to Eretz Yisrael, right? They need the heat. There's the heat. There's the soil. I mean, in Eretz Yisrael, there's uh, Ilonas that are more than a thousand years old. Today. Yeah, all over the Golil, you go around the Golil, there's all over. There's uh, uh, Ilone Zayas, uh, but in Europe it was harder to get Shem and Zayas. It was harder to get Shem and Zayas, you say, but Shaiva was easy for them, easier because uh, bees, bees all over, the world. all over the world, and bees are not that uh, because the, the bees, all you need to have is a summer. Even if it's a short summer, you have to have flowers. You can have bees in Siberia because they hive flowers. The fakir, they, they, they hibernate very well. As long as you leave a little bit of honey for them to live on the whole winter, they're going to live well. They could You could have bees in the middle of Siberia. The, uh, as long as there's a summer and there's flowers that, that, that live live in the summer, the, the bees will take out all the nectar from the flowers and then they find themselves a place to hide for the whole winter. And they have what to eat and beside that. So, so, so in in in, in Eastern European countries, chayve was much easier to get than shaman zayis. Much, much easier. And that's why he's saying over here that it's. He says oiren solo kemuishen. He doesn't say it's better. Not like uh, like some of the shit that are you could you could and it's just as good. He doesn't say it's better. He doesn't say it's better. Um, the, those that say. That it's better. Well, he doesn't say it's better. He doesn't say it's better. He just says. What's the reason we're using for the Shabbos Dap uh, So we will talk about it in a minute, the Pashtus, because. Um, uh, one second, let me just read this. Um, no, Maria, a minute, Pashak Laha had to be Shaiv. The Shaiv and Mitzvah and Ramufka Kamui Bishem and Zayas, Kibavad, it's all no heard it's fame, we call Ashmani. Truth is, yeah. yeah. Even if, even when you read it here, you could say so. Tzolul Tvei doesn't mean from Shemaz eyes. It means it's neck and neck with Shemaz eyes. Vakolba Yesh Madlikin Dafke Benayr Shel Shaim. But he says Mitzvah and Amufka B'Shemaz Eis Shemoy Anei. So the uh, bottom line is. That the mile of Shemazayis is two things. Number one, Nehoide Tzalul Tfei. And the other one is that uh, that uh, the miracle of Mesemiktosh was with Shemazayis. So you could say Shaiva's neck and neck with Shemazayis, Lagabi, the beauty of the fire. But Lagabi, Mesemiktosh, Mesemiktosh, Shemazayis. Okay. 
Now, now why do we use the shamish and there's no china? So like this. The Pashtus, because, because, because we're going to say later that the shamish needs to be a bigger candle. Why does the shamish need to be a bigger candle? Because uh, one of the re- one of the main reasons of the shamish, Shail is why we have a shamish. Ashi says it should be hekir, that it's a national mitzvah. Okay, so then mitzvah Rashi wouldn't be, it just has to be nikr, it could be lower also. Uh, some uh, shittas hold that the shamish should be lower. But but uh, the main reason that the Rishonim bring for shamish is that just in case of accidentally you're going to use the light. Shemish, so <laughs> so you stop you shamish with the shamish. Now, but we say that a minor should be lamata masarat fachim. So usually when you're standing and you're reading a book or you're looking at a, a newspaper, you're standing higher than asarat fachim. So if you're going to make the shamish higher, so then you're probably using the light from the shamish. So if so if you built your menorah in a way that the shamish is higher, it's okay. But if but your menorah, all the, sha, the the candles are in one line, so how is the shamish going to be higher? If you're going to use all of them, you're going to use sham and zayis. And this one, you're going to use a different type of candle. Now, once you're ready, you can use a different candle. Shaiva is the most mahudir. Why? Because the... the oh, it's nehoire tzolil tfei. It has a certain slilus, a certain beauty in it uh, that doesn't the other candles doesn't have okay what kind of shaman is we'll get to it when we get there <laughs> why don't you sit together with Moshe so you could see oh here there's more in the kitchen. I don't know if it's going to be a Even if it's a Shabbos, in Hanukkah, you light a light the menorah with the Shemanim and Psilos that are possible. Well, Shabbos, will be Shabbos is possible. But in Shabbos, Hanukkah, you're allowed. No, but not for Shabbos. For Hanukkah, Hanukkah menorah. It's very much because you're not allowed to do anything to the light of a so so, and Shabbos, they said you're not allowed to use the bad Shemana Mepsilas. Why? Because the light is going to start jumping, and you're going to fix the light, because you're reading a newspaper, and the light is jumping. So you're going to you're gonna go over there, and you're going to try to fix. But a Chanukah ain't lo nushos lishtamash ba'ain, ela l'roisem balvad. So anyway, you can't use uh, uh, read a newspaper. You can't read a sefer. You can't do anything with the light of the menorah. So why? So if it's jumping, why would you go fix it? So a kof sa'in zakuk yah. You're not mechuv to rekindle it. You're not allowed to use the light. So why would you go fix it? Are you mechuv to rekindle it? No. Are you allowed to use the light? No. So why are you going to go fix it? You're not going to go fix it. You shouldn't be saying that you have to see by the candles by an hour and low. That's why you need a different candle. That you have the shamish to learn loyd a shamish. That's not why you need a shamish. In order to be able to learn, you need a candle. That's why you need a shamish. What we call a shamish. But when you use the shamish, you're using the other lights too. You're only using the shamish. No, because if if, if 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 all the other lights were not burning and you just had the shamish, it would have been good enough, right. presumably. It, you're right. If if the, whatever you're doing now it requires more than just the light of the shamish, it would be also. But presumably, Whatever you're doing now, one candle would be good using, enough. I'm not using the light from the, from the candle. Right. I'm using the light of the sham. But that's the way How do you know? How do you, so you know. All of the, you know. All if you know that you're using, uh, that you're using, uh, that you're doing something now, you're crocheting uh, a yamulke for your anical, and over there one candle is not good enough, you need you seven can. candles. You can use but that's if you can't. We're talking the stama. The stama. Well, whatever you're doing, one candle is good enough. Okay. There is those that say that there is a Tashmish for Kedusha allowed to. 
They say you are allowed to do a Tash Mishal Kedusha. They are allowed to. They are allowed to. Why do you have to put it for, further away? Because it shouldn't be neither kemoisif al takonas chacham. Chacham said if it's the night seven, you should have seven candles. You're putting eight. What are you doing? Eight. eight. Chacham said seven. What are you doing? Eight. So you put it separate. So it's nikkur that it's separate. But then it's elu ein neigum laoisif. Like manich etzlan hashem shemar madal kanedus. What if tvei? We don't make it further away. We put it close. Ah, but the yesh la soisa yoisi oroch meshar kanedus. But we make it taller. That's why we use the regular uh, like this, and this one we use uh, uh, the, the the with beeswax. What happens? There's a few candles. I'm not sure which is the shamash and which. I feel like the 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 the, 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 the we say candles. There's a whole bunch of candles, and then the 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 a bit lit the menorah. Five minutes later, the wind blew out all the candles. But still, some of the candles are dedicated for the mitzvah. Some are the, and some is a shamash. And you don't know. They got mixed up in the box. And you don't know. So we say that, yeah, again, you lit the menorah, the night seven of Hanukkah, and you lit candles. So you don't know. Say you're using the sign box from uh, Walmart. 49 cents. You bought a box of candles. Now, uh, you have seven plus the shamash. But they're all, you know, Red, purple, all kinds of colors. And then five minutes after you lit the menorah, a wind blew it out. And you collected all the candles, you put it back in the box. Middle of the night, say, oh, one second, I want to read a newspaper. You want to take a candle and, and read with it. Oh, but now we don't know which is the shamish and which are the ones that are really dedicated for the mitzvah. So, if you let's say he's going to take the whole box and light all the candles, well, obviously one of them was the shamish, right? One of them was the shamish. Now you can read your newspaper. That's a. It's not a case that me and you're going to have to deal with. It's not such a. But this was how the halakha meaning if the if the candle went out, you don't have to relight it. Yeah. Then you could say that once Wait. the candles, the fire is no longer burning, the candles are cold again. Right. I think it's a fair question. Right, right. So the, the, obviously the Magaram is going according to the opinion that says no, that the that this Kedush and the candle. Even even if so you'll avoid it. Oil and void, right. That's so why we're gonna, in Simitofresh Ayn Zion that the Goinim held that these candles you have to make a fire and burn them. You have well, to make well, a well, special well, fire. Whatever's left over to make a fire yeah, and burn they, them. They do that in right. the Sanic like, so by is, the Burr Park. Yeah, they make, the big, they make a big thing. I, I also like it. I make make a mess in the house. Yeah, I didn't see. Yeah, or like, uh, like, 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 like yeah. Something yeah. Something yeah. Like something like that's right. Huh? Fire this year. Yeah, exactly, exactly. What does it mean? Al Riyad look in that tower? Huh? I don't want the Hamas to be around. Only the Riyad look in that tower. Only the Riyad that they should yes. take the the yeah. the a few candles that mixed in. He's going to light so many of them that he knows for sure the shamash is yeah. one of them. So LA, you so you should do this. LA. In the middle of the night, he wakes up. He wants to yeah, read the newspaper. He said loy bottle. Loy bottle. The davish of minion and the davish of minion is not bottle. Elo yad lek minat teruv is kol kach. Saying you can't take one. You can't take one. Which one? But you I don't know which one. All of them. Take all of them and light them, or whatever amount right. that you know for sure. Right. Let's say there is a the box is fifty candles in here, and you only put in holy candles only seven. So if you're going to take out eight candles, obviously one of them is already kosher. Mm -hmm. Nine candles, for sure. Two of them are kosher. So uh, so you have to use as many candles as you know. At least one of them is kosher, okay. and then you can read your newspaper. Um, I do, I, I, that's why I said this is the look of not Nagaya today. Well, it's not so Nagaya. Yeah, like if you had a blackout. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. It's like a funny halacha. It's not Nagaya to me and you. We, 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 when we want to read newspaper, we turn on the switch. So, Hadloko is a mitzvah. Just the lighting does the mitzvah. 
So if you uh, if if uh, if the uh, if, if the wind blew out the candles, kardim she over his money, ainoi zokkloi doesn't have to bother to rekindle it. I feel a cough so bad at Shabbos, kardim go balat Shabbos, then we begin. Ainoi zokkloi doesn't have to rekindle it. For any malachah she'd look about the takna the kibes of a shogig. Again, if he if it was a shogig that he blew out the candles, ainoi zokkloi doesn't have to rekindle it. If he did be amazing, he has to rekindle it. But it's lachmar a lot to me. Well, I was like, if you want to be machmer and rekindle it, that's fine. But in Lavarak, I can't make a bracha. Ne'er shel cheres, if it's a, it's a, if the, if the, if the, if the menorah is made out of cheres, she'd go lay lach, if nasa yotram, and the kumanai, lay lach else. Somebody like, and he went off to have an avoyla, there's still a lot of Somebody else come and you want to write the menorah, they could use it, right? It's a venza. The pashta din abir, aribe de shokhan oruk, not the way the bach holds, is, yeah. Because Kofsa, uh, uh, after half hour, for other mitzvahs, he could blow out the candles. Well, left over, Whatever else, he could do. Uh, right, could, someone else could use it. Even for next night. Or for the next night, yeah, not a problem. Neshach Kedis, you'd look at my Laila Achas, Nasa Yoshem, and look at Laila Kedis, and the Kech Adoshem, and the Kech Laila, and the Mela Yoshem, and the Sikh of Laila Bur, and the Neshem Matachis, 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 and the Neshem Matachis. So, and so he's basically the the if the menorah is made out of cheres, it's yeah, what happens is cheres is so ichi. Once you use it once, it's okay, it's black, it's it. black and ichi. So if you put it back in the oven, it's as if it come out fresh. It's like a new loaf of bread. It's it's it's. Uh, uh, but uh, as though you're not supposed, to, it's not covered for the mitzvah. It's not covered to the mitzvah. But if it's made out of a precious metal or metal or that, that glass, that's. That's fine. That's what we use. That's what we use. But you can yeah. wipe it down. Right. It's the right. right. The test is you can clean it. Because the chuch is you can clean it. You can make it nice. But right. this, you can't make it nice. Any question about Silas Lachlifa at your tichla? You don't have to be saying, it's a mitzvah. So why are you going to take it? If you have a wig, what are you going to do? You take it out and not use it? It's not nice. So maybe we should say you're obligated to always reuse the other ones. And so you're not obligated. If you feel that putting in a new wig is going to be better for you, you're allowed to do that. You're not obligated. You don't go to jail for taking the old wigs and putting it aside. Okay. Let's go back to the Mishnah Blue. Not much here in the label of the message. It's perfect. It's perfect. Let's read fast. There's bad wicks. There's bad, but they're they're all. One second here. Let me show you. Are you listening? Yes. Shmanim shen igurim shen nitla in shachem vachap psila. Tafre shayin gimel sif aleph in the mishnah berurim. Hanikiyes shmanim igurim shem shachem vachap psila. There is bad. There is oils that are bad. Vachenyes psilim igurim shen nitla yof men. There is wicks that are bad. Shabbos also had liquor, and Shabbos is not allowed to use it. The Saldite, the the Lachana Posse Gam can let liquor shavel the Kibu, Mashmalan, and Quachas of the Camelon. Pofsa ain't Zakikla, because Lachana, we say once the candles are blown out, you don't have to rekindle it. So the Kimish Hitlik, Nasa, Zechelan, Nes, and Nikmara Mitzvah. So, so what are you scared? So, big deal, little. They want to, to look. There's a guy, Shabbos, we want that you should, when you eat, you should have a dining experience with the candles on the table. So if the 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 ain't so you're not going to have a, a nice dining experience. You're dim you can hear exactly. Shaining the exactly. That's the best type of wig. You're not allowed to use. Boss of a cholov type of uh, thing for your menorah because you're having a noah. And they're going to have to be a mission. Echem, Tamil, Moise, Hel, Tsarisha, and Noise, Dermel, and Neri, Ikra, Loisen, Noise, Ner, Lacholach, and Nevai, Yochlach, and Ladak, Nesh, Shem, and Vashen, Shashem. If you have a menorah and you're holding day seven, you can't have one candle made out of olive oil, one made out of shiva, one, you know, whatever. You can't do that. You do all seven shaman's eyes, all seven paraffin candles, all seven whatever you you uniform. pick. Huh? They should look, should look uniform. uniform. If they oil, you can't mix. Uh, huh? 
he cooked he took cooked the fat from a cow with, with milk. So now it's it's you're not allowed to cook it. You're not allowed to recook it. You can't have enough. Well, I can't have an, because he wants to use this fat for his manure instead of olive oil. Me and you are not doing it, so it's not so. You can't have you know a dairy one and and and. Uh, and yeah, he mixed the milk and meat, and he made candles from it. Ah. It's a tray for candle. Osubano. It's Osubano, yeah. Nech Hanukkah? It's not only because Osubano, but you can say Mrs. Lala Hans, but you're lighting it. Yes. And it's you're being a bashari. Yeah. Again, Bosubano. Right. Right. You're making again Bosubano. 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 Nech Hanukkah. Ah, Avaloyla Shamish. The Shamish has to be a good candle. We find a rat in the shaman. It's moz, but also in the echanik. It's repugnant. You can't just take the rat out of the olive oil and use the olive oil. Would you drink that olive oil? No. So don't lie, don't, it's not the covered for the Amish to. Huh? I don't know. A roach is not as bad. How about fly? Uh, no. If I use it in your stool, you can take it out. Yeah, a fly is not as bad as a as a, as a cockroach, <laughs> and a cockroach <laughs> is not as bad as a rat. Shiva, the whole market mitzvah, a shel shemen, tveim and edish shiva, the shemen nas an neis. Feel about the shabbos shemet tefer b'tzolam and salka dait and echus that come b'alma and echus shabbos shemen like tid like yofav yata and ech. And when it comes to the Hanukkah, we say, So anyway, you can't use the light. Why is the person going to fix the candle? Why is he going to fix it? He can't, read he can't anyway read. So not going to help him. So the Rajba says, and we pass in that way, that uh, that uh, that when do we say Friday night? You can use any oil, any wick. If you only put a half hour of oil or mashu kaze, but if you put oil for six, seven hours, so then the first half hour you're not allowed to use it because it has a din of nechanika. After that, it doesn't have the din of a nechanika. It's not kind of nechanika anymore. So, so then you, 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 you then, then oh, then it's muta l'shtam mishloira. Now you have to use the kosher wicks and the kosher shemen. But that wouldn't hold true like the Bach. The Bach that I mentioned on Sunday, the Bach says that that uh, that whatever oil you put in is dedicated to the mitzvah, and that all even for seven hours or twelve even hours of oil, even, uh, even uh, as long as you did not make it tonight otherwise. Then this has the kedusha for twelve hours of an er menorah, so you could say that's a chumrah, but it's a kula. Now, uh, even if it's Shabbos and I have twelve hours of oil, but it's still it's also lishtam mishloir the whole twelve hours. So who cares that if it's kosher Hashem or or, or kosher apsilus or not? But make sure you have a shamash. Now you have to have a shamish that needs to last for 12 hours. Otherwise, you do. You are using that. Right. So, Punkt, my brother, I was telling him this uh, there's a tell, today. He tells me, he, he saw a Tamatokim, and he told him, no, it's not true. The Elyar Abba says that as long as the, the, the nair is burning, I have, because I was saying that the Minik Chabad is to sit for a half hour next to the candle. What happens? You light the candle, you give an important phone call. Or you have to run, do something. You say, okay, listen, I put enough oil to last for seven, eight hours. I'll, I'll, I'll come back for two, three hours and I'll sit down with a rambam, with atitas, don't worry. I have, I'm behind the rambam, I have what to do. So, so, uh, so, so, so I said that the poshta didn't shulchan aruch after half hour is muta l'shtam shloide. This is not a nechanika anymore. It is nothing, this candle and chanika has no connection. But if you hold like the Bach, the Bach holds even if you put oil there for 12 hours, it has a din in their Hanukkah. Okay, Agam the Shukhanar doesn't hold of it. But it, okay, for this Chabad Minig that uh, you're sitting next to and you want to say, I'm sitting next to a Hanukkah candle, it's good enough because you could rely on the Bach. Okay, continue. 
Um, well, it's got in, in Zion. Uh, you're not allowed to use the, the candle of, um, of a Hanukkah. Even the extra lights, it's also lishtamish loyed. extra lights, it's also lishtamish loyed. Even the extra lights, it's also lishtamish Why? Because Rashi says, it's a, we want it to be nikr that's near neis mitzvah. Why? Because it says, it's a nikr that's near neis mitzvah. It's a nikr that's near neis mitzvah. It's funny, he, he just throws in, and then he's going to say a third reason, but he doesn't explain the Mishnah Burra what's the difference of the reasons. We dealt with it a little bit. The Rishonim brings several reasons. Uh, the is four reasons why Why is it Rashi says, in order should be naked that it's a near mitzvah. The Gemara says, the Gemara also says, because it's mukta. The Ran also says, and the Alevi also says, because we treat it. Like the Menoir and the Beis Amikdash, like the story that I told in Shabbos, uh before Musav, that we treat it like a Borachul's candle. Just like the story that the magic candle from a Borachul. We treat the Menoir in our house as if a candle came from the Menoir and the Beis Amikdash and came into our house and is sitting in our Menoir. It's not allowed to use it. So, um, so, um, I, so what I was saying, Shabbos, the, the Shabbos is, we're going to learn now the Mishnah Bruder, the Mishnah Bruder brings, and in Barichas he brings in the in the Bir Alocha, that even the opinion that says here that also Lishtamish Lahoyden, if you know the end of the room and it's not such a bizarian, you're allowed to be Mishtamish. That's what he brings, and he says that's the Alocha. But the problem is he forgot that he contradicted himself in Milcha Shabbos. So the problem is he contradicted himself in Milcha Shabbos. In Milcha Shabbos, it's, we say, that um, the uh, the Hilchah Shabbos it says that the Mogavram says and the Alter of the Mishnah Bura passing that way that if you use the uh, not kosher Hashem and not kosher Psila, even if you're in the other end of the room and even if you just want to read a newspaper for one second that's also Shemayata. So so the so the Karban Asanal says wait a minute the Rosh says the Rosh says here and this is this is. Uh, what the Mishnah Berurah the Rosh says that on Hanukkah, if you're gonna if you're gonna use the if you're gonna take the Hanukkah gelt and you're gonna go right next to the the light of the Menoid and start counting the Hanukkah gelt azoi by the light of the Menoid, uh, that you're not allowed to do. But if you know the end of the room, you're allowed to do it. So says the Korban Sanim. You see, uh, and, and what do we say? We say, don't worry, the guy's not gonna be mata. But maybe he'll be in the other room and if you count the money and he'll get a run to be matas. So we see if he's not in the room, we're not choshish. So why in Shabbos you say you are choshish? So he said that the Mogam Ram is wrong. Well, the Pope, the Mogam Ram is not wrong. Al Tereb and Mishnah Bura bring him. So the answer is that because we talk it on passing like the Rosh and Shulchan Aruch, the simple words in the Shulchan Aruch is that anything is also. I feel a little dikmos, a little nice and also. I feel a tashmish kedusha to a little more hakel also. And also means everything is also. It's not you're not allowed to be even on the other end of the room, even to count one dollar. You're not allowed to. It's also, and that's why we're not choshesh shemayata, because it's also. But if it would have been muta to do even something in the other end of the world, we are scared shemayata. And if a Shabbos, if you use the bad psilus shemonim, even if the other in the room, you're not allowed to do a- a- anything to read in the other end of the room. So therefore, the Alter Rebbe Shtim today are good. I don't know why he's making here. I'm there. Smart man. It's mixed. Fun. Give a read, maybe for Shabbos, they're more strict. It's in the eyes of income, but and so the Gemara connects it. The Gemara says Shabbos because it's mutter l'shnam shloi rechshin and shemayat. Kanaka is also l'shnam. So therefore, he's not going to be yad. The Gemara made the connection. The Gemara connected the two things. So if you hold taka like it's the poshtip shat here in Shulchan Aruch, then a Kanaka you're not allowed to use it even if at the other end of the room. You're not allowed to use the light. So, and then I say, oh, because that's why he's not going to be mata, because anyway, he can't use the light. But in Shambas, even in the other end of the room, you're not allowed to read a newspaper. Because if you're going to read, Shemayat. So now it all makes sense. And that's the way the Altar Rebbe learns there. And presumably the Altar Rebbe would have learned this way here too. Ah, and this is what I say, was I saying Shabbos. I said it, I simplified it in my drosha. But now I want to explain what I'm what I was saying. 
That's why we need the extra reason of the Ran that we treat in the Hanukkah candles like the natives in the base of Mikdash. If we should say that the whole why ain't on Rishus Lishtamish Memelerais and Balvat is because it's a bizarre. So you're saying, oh, you're standing next to Hanukkah Menorah and you're counting Azoi. It's a bizarre. At the other end of the room, it's not a bizarre. But if you say we treat the Menorah in our house like the Menorah in the base of Mikdash, it's hectic. It's Mi'ila. Even if you are there in the room, it's also. That's why the Ran added another reason. When the Gemara says, also Lishtam Shloida, he felt it meant unequivocal, even on the other end of the room. So therefore he said, why? If it's Bizoyin, it would only be if you're standing next to the candle. That's why he added the other reason, that we treat it like the Menorah in the Beis HaMikdosh. Now, that, if you were learning Torah by the Menorah... It'd be also... Because just like in the base of Mikdash, you would not allowed to be learned to either by the no, candle of the base of Mikdash. Yeah, it's a meal. It's awesome. So Tamatar would not be, even though that's also Kodesh, that, sure. would, not, that would be no Right, because it's not a bazillion. It's nothing to do with bazillion. Not a bazillion. A person takes money from Hektish and buys a safe Toyota. It's a meal. It's not a bazillion because you're not allowed to use Hektish. Hektish is dedicated. This oil is dedicated for the Menorah. It's to be used for the Menorah. And if you use it for anything else, it's a meal. So, and that's the Chiddush of that. This year, it's pursuing Nisa, so that you could think that since anyone passing by will be, will, it will publicize the Nais. But that's not the Tashmish. That's just uh, the virus of the Nais. That's like so we learned in the Gemara, that the Eidus is Shashchina Shoyda So that, that's, uh, let, let's just read a few lines to get to the bottom. Uh, and the standard Mogan Ram held that way because it was Lushitos and Hilcha Shabbos. So it really makes sense. Also, the Shaloyets of Zuzuz, the Lava Dafka, the Zeshok upon Tashm Sarah, the Koshe and Tashm, whom Rashi Lay should be based on Shashin and Hanaka de Lakis. You're not allowed to use it, but you can't say, oh, you have to walk out of the room because there's no other light. And, and with this light, you're not going to trip. No, that we don't. That's OCD. I feel a tashmish shall kedusha because it's not tashmish. I feel a tashmish shall kedusha. Medivra taz mochik bladei rishona. Also, I feel a limud derech arik. I feel a derech keva. I feel derech shni. Also, I bear aloch and mashik kasev the bezan. I already mentioned outside what the bear aloch said, and he just contradicts himself from Shabbos to Chanuk. Also, v'chem benerish shal benis knes em shtam shulah af tashmish kedusha kamei bebayis. With the hainim yitzel spal ma'ida vetzlam. Like he says, he can't even use the candles of the menorah to have a mitre next to it. Uh, okay, anyway, we have electricity in the house. It's it's, uh, it's not a big deal. Turn the page. Right? It's an extra thing that we have a shamash. I am a man of Rosh if there's 17 minorities on a table, still each one should have their own shamish. Each one should have their own shamish. Don't have to say that way, but okay. Yosef Aruch. As long as the shamash is taller, so whenever you're going to use it, you're going to be end up using that. Sort of. Okay, that's it. Where are we? Okay, we are on page Kufmem Gimel, and this is where we're going to stop for tonight. This is where we're going to stop for tonight. Yitzchak is not here. We are there. Yitzchak is here. Oh, Yitzchak is here. Yitzchak said he went down with us. He just went to the bathroom. Yeah, we have 10 people on the show. So we have an unbelievable Chiddush. We treat the Menoida in our house like the Menoida in the Beis HaMikdash. Maybe shall help that every one of us, uh, tomorrow night when we light the Menoida, 
that we should see the Baruch candle in our candle. And we should see the real menorah next week. Amen. We should be zorich attack it to be see the menorahs in the base of Mikdash. Amen. This week? No, it takes seven days. Oh. Yeah, because I made okay. that comment to someone, and they corrected me. They said it takes seven days to oh. get a proper menorah. Am I right, Rabbi? No, it says that the, 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 the really? seven days, because it, it, they have to take the Pora Duma, Spritz it on a person on day three and day seven, yeah. and then the person could make Shema's eyes with So they were missing. So it takes seven days. That's what the person said to me. Seven so days it takes. It it okay. it, uh, but maybe we'll find that this. Uh, oh, the horse yeah, same, 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 same page of China. No, but it's not going to help because the Toyin that, that's doing the avoid is going to be Metamid. Yeah. They were Toyin. Yeah. Yeah. The Shema was Toyin. But by us, we're all to make mace. We're all to make mace. Yeah. So you, you can do that avoid the tumor also. Yeah. 